I'm not going to cry all the time, nor shall I laugh all the time. I don't prefer one strain to another. I'd have the immediacy of a bad movie, not just a sleeper, but also the big, overproduced, first-run kind. I want to be at least as alive as the vulgar. All to the good. I don't wear brown and gray suits all the time, do I? No. I wear work shirts to the opera often. I want my feet to be bare. I want my face to be shaven and my heart. You can't plan on the heart. But the better part of it, my poetry, is open. How does it affect you when you read a poem that you've forgotten? Is it like reading something written by someone else? Well, this time I was just faking it because, the, you know, I, uh, for the purposes of continuity, I had to read this poem, but I, I hadn't read it for some time, and uh, I left out a verse, and uh, I'd forgotten the meaning of the whole poem. Does this in any way disturb you? Isn't, isn't every poem a part of you as a poet? Well, uh, it doesn't disturb me because I don't think anything was at stake. But uh, I, I think that uh, that uh, that uh, the message comes through, you know, with the uh, with the body, with the eyes and the voice. You could really be reading the uh, instructions from a shoe polish can. What's the point of writing poetry then, if you could just as well read instructions on how to polish your shoes? 